And finally, more than 200 people today received medical treatment they typically couldn't afford thanks to remote area medical. 10 News reporter Mark Salinger introduces us to the people Ram is helping out. Under the cover of night, hundreds of people slept in their cars, holding their place in a line worth waiting in. All the pain that I'm feeling, it's definitely going to be worth it. Through these doors lies a land of opportunity, seldom accessible to most who showed up Wednesday morning. It's too expensive to go anywhere else. Dentists, doctors, and veterinarians volunteering their time turn an empty building into a makeshift hospital waiting for people like Christy Robertson to arrive. With minimum wage being what it is and what people make day to day working, you can't afford to pay any extras. She has health care, but the stay at home mom can't afford to use it. For the one filling that I was going to have to pay $80 for, it's very worth it. That $80 could go to my child. Christy waited more than 17 hours in line to get a cavity filled. She's been dealing with the infected tooth for a year. It's actually going to help me improve my self-esteem. You don't see this much. Not anymore. Not today. 19-year-old Caitlin Luthi drove more than an hour to get here. My eyes are awful. I can't see a thing. Nothing compared to the seven hours she waited in her car for the opportunity to see clearly again. You put on your old pair of glasses, right? And you're like, whoa, all right. And then, like, you put on your new pair. And everything is just explosion of colors and definition, and it's absolutely wonderful. Whether it be a new pair of glasses or a new smile. There's no more hole. You can call them medical miracles. I don't have to be afraid to smile. Or you can see them as lives forever changed. Mark Salinger, WVIR 10 News. Wow. Remote Area Medical expects more than 2,500 people to walk through the clinic doors at Chilawi Park in East Knoxville, and they are open through Sunday. It is